Hello everybody, my name is Vinay Jacob John. Please visit my two websites www.jesushealsministries.org and prayingtongues.org. Today we are going to read from the book of John in the New Testament of the Holy Bible. The book of John chapter 1 verse 1. In the beginning was the word Jesus Christ and the word Jesus Christ with God, our Lord God Jehovah and the Holy Spirit and the word Jesus was God. The same Jesus was in the beginning with our Lord God Jehovah and the Holy Spirit. All things were made by you Jesus and without you Jesus was not anything made that was made. In him, in Jesus Christ of Nazareth is life and the eternal life is the light of men. Also let us turn to the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5 verse 17. Therefore, if any man be in Jesus Christ of Nazareth, he is a new creation. All things, or a whole spiritual man, have passed away. Behold, all things, or all people, have become new. There is also turn to the book of Galatians, chapter 2, verse 20. I am crucified with you, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Nevertheless, I live, yet not I, but you, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, flesh here in this planet earth, I live by the faith of the Son of God, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Jesus loved me, and Jesus, you gave yourself for me. Also, let us turn to the book of First Peter, chapter one, verse twenty-three. Being born again, not of corruptible seed but of incorruptible seed by the word of God, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Jesus Christ of Nazareth lives and abides forevermore. Also, let's turn to the book of 2 Peter, chapter 1, verse 4. Whereby are given unto us exceeding great and precious promises, that by these we might be partakers of the divine nature of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, having escaped the corruption that is in this planet of earth through lust. And beside this, giving all diligence, add to your faith virtue, and to virtue knowledge, and to knowledge temperance, and to temperance patience, and to patience godliness, and to godliness brotherly kindness, and to brotherly kindness charity. For if these things be in us and abound, they make us that we shall neither be barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Wherefore, the rather brethren, give diligence to make your calling and election sure, for if we do these things, we shall never fall. We remember, Lord Jesus, that we were purged from our own sins. Verse 11, For so an entry shall be ministered unto us abundantly into the everlasting kingdom of our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you everybody for listening to me today. Please visit my two websites www.jesushealsministries.org and also prayingtongues.org. I am Vinay Jacob John. Jesus loves us all. Jesus heals us all. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen.